I feel it's ex extremely dangerous because we're saying that, you know, um, it's okay. A billboard located in a busy intersection in Modesto has triggered outrage from parents who want it taken down. The advertisement shows two women in skimpy outfits promoting marijuana products. CBS 13's Carlos Correa is in Modesto to show us the image that has a lot of people upset. The billboard went up a few days ago and with schools nearby, parents are concerned it's sending a wrong message. Two women hardly wearing any clothes on a billboard in Modesto has caught the attention of a lot of people, from nearby businesses to parents. I just don't think that our children need to see that. We have so much, you know, um, peer pressure that we're, um, parents have to fight against. And now a billboard that they can see every day, every time they leave their home, every time they come home. It's just really upsetting. The advertisement is from Ignite Cannabis Company. The ad, which is located right by a high school and an elementary school, is promoting marijuana products, which include vapes used to smoke the drug. It states the products are available inside dispensaries. Parents say the images are inappropriate. Basically selling sex and, and derogatory towards women. I don't want to see pictures like that, you know, and a lot of other people don't either. The city of Modesto does not regulate ads on billboards. A spokesperson says the advertisement does, however, have to be approved by the FCC. We reached out to the company running the ad. A spokesperson for Ignite Cannabis says the billboard meets all requirements and is in compliance and far away from schools. And it gives the, the, the wrong message, you know what I mean? Because because what, what, are, what are we saying to the next generation? Outfront Media owns the billboard, which has been located near Sullivan Avenue and Oakdale Road for years. It sells space to companies like Ignite Cannabis, which placed its ad two weeks ago. We reached out to the billboard company and are still waiting for a response. A spokesperson for the city says people can and should contact the companies creating the ads directly if they feel offended by what they see on a billboard. Carlos Correa, Modesto tonight. Carlos, thank you.